Hello everybody and welcome to another part of my Minecraft story mode playthrough and I am here in the founder's throne room and we are trying to find the Eversource. Um, let's see if uh, let's see if Milo knows anything about it or where you believe it, we it is. Got in. Yes, I'm very grateful to you for all of your help. Give yourself some credit, Milo. You've done Build Club proud. Okay, maybe not. <laughs> See if I for maybe knows, because I was pretty smart with all this stuff. So, how was prison life? Oh, it was wonderful. I've always wanted time behind bars to work on my poetry. That was sarcasm, <laughs> in case you were curious. Oh, do you know what? I am noticing that there is a uh, cobblestone generator. Do you reckon hmm. we can um, <gasps> use it? A cobblestone generator. Amazing! Lava and water. Placed exactly far enough that when they collide, it creates cobblestone. Genius! I don't know if we need to use that. So what, I'm just going to have a little search around again. There is some books over here. I'm not too sure how they will help us. But I may as well uh, just have a quick look at them and see what's going on here. Habits of the Enderman. Oh, Soren? Soren. Well, how'd that get here? Okay. So it's definitely not in there. There's nothing in about the ever source in there. Um, there was some train tracks. Yeah, there were train tracks over here that I noticed. And oh, redstone and a block doorway. I think I know how we can do it actually with the cobblestone generator. From this. Yeah. What happened to it? Just need to make something to activate that redstone circuit again. There's got to be something in here we can use. Like a lever. If you can find one of those bad boys, we'll have that secret door open in a snap. We're going to have to to use the uh, the cobblestone generator and maybe this tree over here. Um Oh, a dead bush. We can get a, a stick Poor from that, can't bush. we? Barely more than a bundle of sticks. No, we can't. We can use it, can we not? Hopefully no one will miss one dead bush. Okay, so now if we go over to the cobblestone generator and grab the cobblestone. And there we go. It's back again. He's ingenious. Yeah, and it should be just the thing to make a lever with that stick I found. And then we head over to this crafting table. I don't like how this water looks, by the way. It's flowing, and I don't like it. Okay, let's do this. Um, and then we can uh, put the cobblestone in. We can do it like this. There we go. Yeah, we've got a lever. Nice. Ah, my old friend the lever. Fantastic! Ow. Didn't know you were watching. My apologies. It is still just such a thrill to see someone so confident and sure in their building abilities. Okay, right, and then we can head over to this door. And, oh, I'm going all over the place. And we can put the lever down. And hopefully, should like show us a secret passageway. It does as a minecart. Excellent. This is it. Eversource, here we come. Okay, let's go. Let's go on a journey <laughs> down here. I don't know if we should be doing this. It looks like a mine. And Jesse's scared as well. Chests. Yeah, and they're all labeled? Creeper, zombie, sheep, pigman. Curious. But what does it mean? Sheep. Hmm. Huh. Is that a spawn eggs. egg? The sign says sheep, not eggs. Might as well throw it and give it a shot. So they have spawn eggs on this island. <laughs> A little bit of a, a creative mode, little glitch there. <laughs> is, is that a monster? That's not so bad. It is fluffy. The eggs all have creatures inside them. And they're all different colors. They must be, you know, color coded. What's in them? So she can just spawn things whenever she wants to. So this must be where the resources come from. Different monsters and creatures, different drops. Stay on your toes. We're close! Ah! I can't wait! 
Let's take a look around. Okay, so let's try. I really want to find this ever source. I want to see what the ever source is because we still don't know what it is. We've never seen it before. Um, but I really do want to find it. And oh, oh, hello. Some of a crown on his head. Is that, is that the ever source? A chicken. We've, we've got a chicken. That's the ever source. Incredible. <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> Um, the Eversource is a chicken? What? Yes, the spawn eggs. It's so simple. Wait, 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 wait. That's the Eversource? So the chicken lays the eggs, and the eggs make monsters, and the loot from the monsters made this place. Well, throw it in the minecart and let's get out of here. We're still taking it, right? The chicken that the entire city depends on? Are you sure that's a good idea? What are you talking about? We need to bring it to the people! With it, we'll finally be free of the founder! But that clucking thing is what we came for! Ivor, jeez, Lucas is right. We can't just steal, uh, kidnap... Chicken nap? I agreed with him earlier. I don't need to agree with him again. <laughs> what? I thought that was the whole point of this adventure. Uh oh. I knew it. I knew you were here to steal from me. Ah, uh, pain. Oh, she's too fast. No, 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 no one stealing anything. The chicken. The, the Eversource is staying right here where it belongs. Don't worry. It's just I like this I music. You, Founder, they're here to steal the Eversource. Classic this is awesome. The stone. You don't say. What? No! Don't believe them! You have the wrong idea! Oh. Shut up, criminals. Oh, this is ridiculous. It's all lies! You just expect me to believe a bunch of criminals? Aiden warned me that you were a pack of thieves, and here you are, prepared to make off with the one thing our city depends on to survive. Boy, when you put it like that, I almost feel bad. Yep, afraid I'm going to be taking the chicken. It's mine now. And he wants to be the hero. This is outrageous. <laughs> Aiden, don't do this. Somebody order eggs. Uh oh. Creeper, look out! Oh no! <laughs> look at a sheep hanging on! <laughs> no! I've got Aiden! Save the founder! Oh, do you got me, Lucas? Got you! Let's bring her, let's bring her back up. Thank you, thank you. No, 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 Lucas. <laughs> Wait, <that> it... <laughs> okay. End of the game then. I don't know how this progresses from here because for this, we've fallen off the I'll island. The genuinely here. is no land under here. We're, we're done. We're screwed. Oh, dear. Oh, no. This is our fault. I saved you. Serious. Yeah, I'm serious. Trusting the blaze rods, hiding the Eversource, I didn't do any of that. Hmm, I can't decide whether I want our death to be painless for my sake or excruciating for yours. Land! Impossible. That's impossible. Jesse? There! Can we get to it in time? Gonna be close! Let's swim, let's swim. Swim in the air. Try can I hit the lava? <laughs> 
<laughs> it was so worth it. That was the funniest thing ever. Oh, and I've got to replay it. I don't get why it gets your fault. night, daytime. Thanks to you, we get to see what really happens when you fall off the island. Hey, you can't pin this on me. This is your fault. Are you serious? Yeah, I'm serious. Trusting the blaze rods, hiding the Eversource, I didn't do any of that. Hmm, I can't decide whether I want our death to be painless for my sake or excruciating for yours. There we go, there's the land again. <laughs> Let's not go into lava this time. Man! Impossible. That's impossible. Jesse? There. Can we get to it in time? Gonna be close. Yeah, maybe that's not land in the lava this time. <laughs> yeah, that was a bad idea. I think I've mostly made it. There we go. What now? Am I just gonna fall for eternity? There we go. If I. Is that the, the sheep? Look at the sheep! <laughs> That's amazing! Uh. Ah. That's amazing. Jesse? Holy crap, you're down here too? Lucas, you made it! Oh. Yeah, only slightly worse for wear. Ah, gotta say, Aiden's tougher than I remember. Mm. Yeah, I mean, pretty good. Lucas, I'm really sorry I didn't try to help you up there. I only had a few seconds. Everything was happening so fast. No, no, don't worry about it. Aiden was, uh, <laughs> stronger than I was expecting. It was good of you to try and save the founder. Uh, speaking of whom, is she okay? She's just sort of staring. I think she's taking it all in, I reckon. Uh, let me ask. Founder? Miss Founder? I, uh, hope she's not in shock or something. You, uh, doing okay over there? I just, I... I can't believe it. <sighs> mm. This has been down here the whole time. I oh. forbade anyone to look for land below us. I just don't understand. Why did you never even look or send someone down? Hey, take it easy. She's having a rough enough day as it is. No, no. That's okay. I, I was too cautious. I didn't want to create false hope, and I was so certain that the only thing down here was death. Well, it's not. Look at this place. Totally untouched biomes all around us. Yes, it's all a little overwhelming. What, what do I do now? Well, how about you start with a few deep breaths? <laughs> Seeing all oh. this after you've been crammed on There we go, let's let's that save this to a would be overwhelming for anybody. First things first, we're gonna go back up there and kick Aiden's butt. Sounds like the start of a winning plan to me. Getting back up. My word, you're right. We need to do that. I hadn't even thought that far ahead yet. Uh oh. Aiden spawned a bunch of mobs. Oh, that's not a good sign. Definitely a bad sign. Your city's probably in big trouble right now. I can't believe Aiden could be so stupid. Me neither. I can't leave my subjects in whatever trouble they're in. Jesse, will you please help me get back to Sky City? Stop Aiden. Help me protect my people. Of course I'll help you. You're the founder. Thank you, Jesse. And please. Call me Isa. Okay, Isa. Getting back up. Back up. Let's see what we've got to work with. Hmm, huh, that'll work. What is it? Ah, I see where you're getting at. Nice. We need to start gathering dirt as much as we can. Uh, how will that help? We're gonna build a tower of dirt all the way back up to Sky City. Grab as much dirt as you can carry. Okay, well, let's dig. Okay, let's just have a little bit of a break. Okay, let's keep digging. Okay, uh, I can have another okay. break. That should do it. Jesse, 
What is that? Uh, Once I get my flint and steel back from the blaze rods, it'll be my ticket out of here. Well, guys, you ready? Yes, I, I think so. I, uh... I actually gotta sit this one out, Jesse. Hidden got me pretty good. I'm just not sure I'm up for towering all the way back up there. It's fine, Lucas. I'm really sorry. I probably wouldn't be able to keep up anyway. Yeah, you don't look so good. You should rest up. Try and get some food. That's what I was thinking. Thanks for understanding. No worries, Lucas. You're my mate. And we always stick together, we do. Oh, we're not like the the ocelots, the blaze go, rods. <laughs> Thank you for trying to help. It was very noble. Hey, what's with the last goodbye tone? I'll see you guys when you get back. Oh, give Aiden another punch for me. Will do. Come on. I'll Got try and kill him, mate. <laughs> right, let's keep. Let's just build up here, and then we're up at the city. Ready? I believe so. And when I get up there, I'm going to tear those blaze rods limb from limb. That's raining. them. Oh, and Jesse, I appreciate what you did up there. Trying to save me, I mean. <laughs> He's doing it so slowly. Without even looking down, that's a skill that nobody else has. Alright, oh, let's have a little bit of a break. Let's wait for founders to catch up. I'm no joke, it's a race. Nah, the founder's not even coming up to us. <laughs> I love doing that, it's so funny to me. <laughs> oh no. No, we need to get in there now. Go, 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 don't stop! Dark, dark. There we go. Oh, there's a gas behind you. Whoa, that was crazy. Are you okay? <gasps> what have they done? Let's kill him. Let's kill the zombies. What is going on here? The city is under attack by monsters now. Everywhere. They seem to be coming from inside the palace itself. Come on, we need to stop him. I'm sorry, Jesse, but I have to save my people. Take care of yourself out there, okay? And to you as well. Yes, you're alive. Please, can you help us? Hang tight, Milo. Oh, oh. I missed the cue. A <laughs> spider jockey. I've got the spider. Don't you even worry about it, Milo. You are very quick on your feet. But with all seriousness. I saw you go over the edge. Okay, quick version. You know how you all thought there was nothing but void below you? Yes. Yeah, that was wrong. There's land. You speak truthfully, my friend? No. Well, I can't wait to hear all about it later. I gotta get to the palace. Thank you, my friend. We'll see you on the other side. Where's Ivor and Petra? Right, that's Petra. I don't see Ivor yet. Like that, huh? Blade Rod! Ooh, hey. Hmm. Jesse, you're alive? <sighs> Ivor, that's Ivor. Aiden has taken over the palace. He's holed up in the throne room, throwing those spawn eggs everywhere. No one could get inside. We need to stop him. I know. Jesse, take one of these. Can I take all three? Uh, invisibility. 
any potions of invisibility? Here! Can't stop what you can't see. Alright, let's keep going, let's go. No, 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 I want to punch <laughs> no, that's funny. Down and get out of my face, Reggie. You're delusional, Aiden. The people of Sky City will True, die. true. You killed the Boo, Aiden, yeah? boo. Well, you're gonna be next if you don't. Aiden, you've lost. I saw you fall. You went down. You're alive. You're alive. Is the founder with you? Ah! What the? Not one more step. I killed you once. I could do it again. Oh no, that wasn't the one I wanted to choose. <laughs> Just die already. I don't know which one I wanted to choose, but definitely wasn't Get the dot dot dot. That's five, let's try and kill Adian. And um, we kill with the blaze rods, please. Uh oh. He's coming for us. I was itching my leg. Almost lost that fight. This was supposed to be my world! And you ruined it! Listen to yourself, that's insane! Oh! Why couldn't you have left go, 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 go. Yes, yeah, so we're defeating Aiden. Oh, blaze rods again. Or oh, blazes again, not blaze rods. Oh, yeah! Blazes burn in the rain, don't they? Forgot about that. Alright, let's go up to Aiden. Here we go, Aiden. I want to give you one last punch from Lucas. I love this battle. You just can't stand to see someone else in the spotlight, can you? You just can't let anyone else win. Oh, it just drives you crazy to see someone else succeed, doesn't it? Aiden, this isn't about who wins and who loses. It's about what's right. And that is why you're gonna lose. Let's fight him. This is this is an epic final battle. <laughs> oh, move my hair on my eyes this time. Almost missed it again. <laughs> Come on, knock his sword over the edge. Knock his sword over the edge. And fail, yes. Wait, wait, wait! Hang on, hang on. I, I, I surrender. I surrender. We can talk about this, right? Here, here. You want your blade and steel back, huh? Take it. It's yours. Just please, don't hurt me. Pick it up. You did it, Jesse. We need to get out of here. We did do it. That is right. What do you want to do with him? Please. This place is getting worse by the minute. You can't just leave me here. Take me with you! After everything you've done, I'm not sure you deserve that kind of mercy. No, 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 no! Come on! You can't just leave me behind! If you leave me here, I'll die! Take it, come Back on, moving. Aiden. You're coming with us. Th th thank you. Thank you, Jesse. <laughs> More than you deserve, frankly. Like, you know what? I, I don't. As much as I don't like Aiden. We wouldn't be heroes if we just left him, you know. So I do, I do, I do want to bring him with us. And stay there. Ah! 
That's the founder. You retrieved the Eversource. Yes, ma'am. Everyone, stay together. Jesse, there you are. Jesse, the situation is getting out of hand. We simply can't stop all the monsters and protect my people. The longer we stay here, the more danger my people will be in. I guess we could jump for it. The waterfalls can take us to safety. What? Are you crazy? The waterfalls will just take us into the void. We'll die if we fall down there. But there's nothing but monsters up here. The void won't kill you. There's land down there. Everyone just watch me and follow my lead, okay? The void will kill you. It's just that there's land down there. It's not the fact that the void won't kill you. <laughs> because the void will most definitely kill you if you go into the void. But there is no void. <laughs> Just in the sky. Jesse has done nothing but help us so far. I will show you just how much I believe in Jesse's word. Why was the founder hesitant? The founder knows his land. Oh, somebody just got killed! <laughs> That's amazing. so different what do you do you go have fun you guys were cooped up there so long now you can go do whatever you want uh, uh, oh freeze criminals you're not going anywhere i knew you'd stop him nice work now this is just speculation but i'm guessing they have some regrets knew they wouldn't get away <laughs> what goes around comes around am i right guys Oh, uh, hi, Jesse. I'm, uh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry to cause all that trouble. I can see where it all went wrong. I've, uh, got some regrets, to say the least. I hope you learned a lesson, Aiden. This didn't have to happen like this. It did not, I so... see you have a lot to think about. Yeah, yeah, that's for sure. You were so angry and bitter, Aiden. You were so sure that I was always trying to take things from you, but you were wrong. I won't try to compete with you anymore. Attention! Huh? Attention! Hello, hello everyone, please. This is your founder speaking. Now that we're all safe, we need to organize. Start planning our new community. You so I just find behind them. That's insane. We were prisoners long enough on that island in the sky. It is time for us to run free. Build whatever we please. Wow. Those two just cannot get along. Jesse, I cannot allow my people to be influenced by this naive idealist. Hey, both of you, fighting isn't going to solve anything. It will if I win. Oh, of course you'd think that way. No, you don't understand. It will be night soon, and that is when the monsters come out. If we don't prepare, we'll be in danger. You're just making excuses to control our behavior, just like before. We must trust in ourselves, be able to learn from our mistakes. The people need to build! W what do we do? Who are we supposed to listen to? Uh well, I think you're both right. You don't want to just run around with no plan, but you can't schedule and organize everything either. People need to be free to try new things, but you've got to be safe about it. I suppose I still have much to learn. Thank you, Jesse. I don't understand yet, but I trust you. 
Well, Jesse, yeah, you should. I suppose the we saved you. We saved your your we city. We disagree about how to run this place, but I thank you for everything you have done. I guarantee that we will be telling stories about your visit for many, many years to come. This is a second chance at making a civilization. Don't waste it, okay? I don't intend to. I give my solemn oath. You know something? She was a little scary at first, but she's all right. <laughs> yep. I'm gonna miss that crazy guy. I guess we should prepare for nightfall too. Without another portal, we're stuck here. It's been a while since I've had to start from square one. Oh, that's right. In the middle of all the fighting and everything, I almost forgot. When I was on the ground with the founder before I totally found the portal. And you didn't say anything? Yeah. I'm actually gonna have to agree with Ivor on this one. Oh, my phone. not mention it either? Because I could have sworn I said something. No, you didn't. I guess the moment just never presented itself. Come on. Oh, hi. Ah, oh, there you are. I'm so sorry about her. That's okay. Looks like she's having fun running around. Yes, I think she took it pretty well when I told her she didn't need to be the Eversource anymore. What are we going to do with you now, huh? What are you going to do now? Besides, continue to be adorable, of course. <laughs> but that was a given. Now that you don't have to run everything yourself, maybe you could use the time to travel. There's a lot to see. Yes, that's a rather nice notion. How would you like to go explore some of those, um, very tall vertical rocks? We well, call them mountains, usually. <laughs> Lovely. After so long being the founder and the Eversource, now we can just be Isa and her best friend, Benedict. Ah, that's <laughs> a boy's name! <laughs> what a closed-minded attitude. Jesse, I would be honored if you would take this. As a small token of our gratitude. A crown. Thank you. Come along, Benedict. We have a lot of adventures ahead of us. Well, there goes the Eversaurs. Off to cluck and peck at seeds for the rest of its valuable life. The <laughs> Fabian. Hey, Jesse. You okay? Jesse? No, I just saw those pigs and, you know. Oh. Yes. He would be really happy to know you're still having adventures like this. Right, let's go home, guys. Let's not be sad ever, Reuben. See? Let's Just go like home. I told you. One portal back home. I just can't wait to put this whole world behind us. Oh, is someone being grumpy? No! A little. I was just hoping for a real treasure is all. <laughs> Livestock's no proper treasure. Although I wonder what would happen if you put that tiny crown on a different chicken. Probably nothing. Come on, guys, let's go home. Right, let's do it. Let's light the portal. Let's jump in. We don't Axel and Olivia here where we've been. They'll never believe it. Uh oh, well. Wait. That's not what I was expecting. Oh, portal hallway. Okay, and I think that should be the end of a uh, Minecraft Story Mode Episode Five. And there we go. We get to the two demolished Ivor's lava house. Sixty-five point six percent. Okay. Uh, so I'm gonna let these pass, and I'm gonna look at them, look at the stats myself. So I can't really uh, focus. I'm just going by so quickly. So if I just wait for it to uh, to finish. Um. Come on, there we go. Right, so let's uh, let's actually have a have a quick look. So, sixty five point what five sixty five point six percent of players let Ivor's house stand. Uh, run from the guards and try to help Ivor. I ran from the guards. Forty eight point two did the same as me. Uh, Seventy eight point four percent saved the founder instead of uh, going after Lucas um, or helping Lucas. Um, and then. Uh, for only 43.8% of players uh, helped Aiden to, to safety. And then, I believe, who did you leave in charge of reconstruction? You and 
63.2% of players made Issa Milo share power. And I think that that should be the best answer, honestly. Uh, but anyway, I think uh, we have just about run out of time in this episode. And we have finished the episode of Minecraft Story Mode. Anyway, um, there will be a new episode uh, of my playthrough on your screen. So very, very shortly. Um, but yeah, I would like to thank you all very, very much for watching this video. And I'll see you all later. Bye!